hey guys and welcome back to my channel or welcome if you are new thank you all so much for clicking on this video so today i'm headed into walmart and i have a midweek bonus offer for three dollars when i do eight offers i did already complete one so i really only need seven and honestly i'm just gonna try to do the seven and get out of here i'm not trying to do anything crazy today um so let's try to get seven offers today should be easy but let's see all right so first things first i came to the makeup section to see if they had any more clearance items and they still had quite a bit first item i'm gonna pick up are three of these revlon mascaras for a dollar seventy three of them will equal me five dollars with ten cents i'm gonna use two of these three dollars off of one manufacturing coupons from the one two save insert and then one three dollar off of one from the coupons.com um that will leave them to be completely free and give me three dollars and ninety cents in overage Next, I'm going to pick up two of these Revlon lipsticks. The two I'm going to pick up are the glossy ruby ones because these are cheaper at $1.74. I'm going to pick up two of them to equal me $3.48. with I'm going to use one of the $3 off of one coupons from the one two save insert and then one $3 off of one coupon from coupons.com. That will leave it to be completely free and give me $2.52 in overage. <laughs> Next, I'm going to pick up two of these All May Foundations on clearance for $2.75. Two of them will give me $5.50. I'm going to use two of these $4 for one manufacturing coupons from the one two save insert. Those will give me $2.50 in overage. But then also on Ibotta, we have $4 rebates for this item with a limit of three. So we'll get $8 back on there, making the final cost free and a $10.50 money maker. Next, I'm going to pick up two of these All May Really Brows on clearance for $3.03. Two of them will equal me $6.06. With six cents. I'm going to use two of these $3 off of one manufacturing coupons from the one two save insert. That will leave me to pay just $0.06 cents at the register, but then on Ibotta, we have $3 rebates for this product with a limit of three, so we'll get $6 back on there, making our final cost for both of them free and a $5.94 money maker. <laughs> Last makeup deal is on the All May Eyeshadow. It has to be the number 21 or else it's not going to work, but it's $6.97. I'm going to use one of these $3 off of one manufacturing coupons from the one to save insert. I'll be left to pay just $3.97 in store. And then on Ibotta, there is a $4 rebate attaching to this item and a $3 rebate attaching to this item. So we'll get a total of $7 back on there, making the final cost free and a $3.03 money maker. Next, I'm going to pick up two of these Big Soleil razors for $3.32. Two of them will give me $6 with 64 cents. I'm going to use two of these $4 for one manufacturing coupons from the 1-9 Smart Source. That will leave them to be free and give me $1.36 in overage. Next, I'm going to pick up this Nivea Nourish by Nature Lotion for $5.84. I'm going to use one of these $2 off of one manufacturing coupons from the one to, I think, save insert it is. That'll leave me to pay just $3.84 in store. And then Ibotta has a $2.50 rebate, making the final cost just $1.34. <laughs> Next, I'll be picking up one of these Persil discs for $4.94. For this item, I'm going to use this $2 for one coupon that I got from inside the product. Uh, one that I got a while ago at CVS, but you can check inside the product you're buying and hopefully there's one in there. That'll leave you to pay just $2.94 in store and then I bought it as a $2 rebate, making the final cost just $0.94. Cents. And once again, I'll be picking up five of these Chobani flips for $1.12. Five of them will give me $5 with 60 cents. Um, I did want all peach, but they only had three in peach, so I picked up two other kind. Uh, but for this item, I'm going to use this dollar for five manufacturing coupon from the one to Smart Source. I'll be left to pay just $4.60 in store. And then I bought it has a dollar rebate when you buy five, making the final cost just $3.50 and 50, 60 cents for all five or like 72 cents each next item i'm gonna pick up is the smithsfield tender lion i know that's not how you say it but i just been saying it like that my husband's been correcting me but anyways that's how i'm saying it i'm gonna pick up one that's for five dollars and twenty cents um i bought it there's a two dollar rebate which will make my final cost for this just three dollars and twenty cents 
last day I'm going to do today is on this Thomas Mini Croissants. They are $3.48 in my store. On Ibotta, we have a $1.25 rebate, which will make the final cost just $2.23, which is pretty expensive. But with the All May Money Makers or the Makeup Money Makers, um, I think it will be okay. My mom actually likes croissants, so I thought I would pick something up for her. So I actually forgot I picked this ice cream up. So this is actually the last deal. Um, they have this crunch one. So I'm going to pick up one of the no sugar crunch ones and one of the regular ones at $3.27. Two of them will give me $6 for 54 cents. I'm going to use this $1 off a two paper coupon from coupons.com. There is one on the coupons.com app if you don't have the paper one. That will leave me to pay just $5.54 in store. And then on this coupon coupon the website i'll link it down below i'll put a picture up of it it's giving three dollars back when you buy one with a limit of five and i did this deal already but i only submitted for two times so i can submit for two more times so i'll get a total of six dollars back on there making my final cost for both of them free and a 46 cent money maker So here the cashier had to scan all the products for me since they're locked up, which is okay. Um, so now I'm just going to scan my coupons for all my makeup product and hopefully they all go through with no issue. And then I also did have her price modify the Thomas croissants because they rang up a different price. But I showed her the tag and she had no issue price modifying it to the store tag price they had. So. So I just got done scanning all my coupons. All I have to do is cut one more uh, $4 paper coupon for the All May Face, and then I am done. So here I'm showing you that I scanned everything and everything went through, and here is my final cost for everything. All right guys, so here's everything I picked up at Walmart today. My total for all this before any coupons would have been $65 with 35 cents. I had a total of $46 in coupons. I got a total of $29.75 back from Ibotta for rebates and then $3 back on Ibotta for the bonus. And then on the Kondike rebate, I will be getting a total of $6 back, giving me a total savings of $84 with 75 cents, leaving the final total for everything you see right here to completely free and a $19.40 money maker. And everything went extremely well today. I didn't have any issues with any coupons or any rebate apps. Um, I think the only thing I wish I would have done is picked up more of that Smithfield meat thing. Because my mom, as soon as I got home, my mom made it for dinner. And, and it was actually super good. So I'm. that's the only thing I'm upset about. But it had nothing to do with my couponing. Couponing went well. I'm super happy with everything I picked up. But yeah, guys, this is it for me. This is my whole haul. I hope you guys enjoyed. I hope to help you out with your couponing and putting your deals together. If you guys have any questions, please don't hesitate to ask. I'll always be more than happy to help you guys out in any way that I can. Um, but like always, thank you all so much for clicking on this video, watching what I do. I really appreciate it. I really do appreciate you guys. It truly does mean a lot to me. I am super grateful and blessed for you guys. <laughs> um, but this is it for me. Until next time, guys, have a good day. Bye.